to install the VMware open extract the file tar file and open your workstation click file your virtual machine select the custom then next do not install any operating system type then select Linux Ubuntu 64 bit click next then browse for the path of the extracted file and click OK. Rename virtual machine name. Okay, continue. Select the processes and the virtual processes as per the requirement. Okay, you should give at least one GB for this. Uh, machine click next then use the any like NAT or bridge network like if you wanted to use an external DHCP you can use the bridge network you can use the internal NAT settings you can use the uh, NAT or if you want to use the uh, only host it will not communicate to the out of the host okay use NAT and click next okay Logic will say logic is recommended and use the existing virtual disk here. Click next, then browse for the path where you have your uh, NetApp simulator. Okay, here I have a NetApp simulator. Okay, click open and click next. Keep the existing format, do not convert. Next, okay, then click finish. Okay, or on your return machine. It will not ask you for any username and password for the login of the Ubuntu. So just there is a desktop icon simulator. So click on the simulator. Okay. The NetApp simulator will load. Okay, it's the version is 7.3. Just wait for the uh, system to boot, like the NetApp simulator to boot. It will not take much time, like it will take one or two minutes time to load. So the system will uh, load it. So just the username is root. The password is kernel one two three. Okay. So it's logged in. So you can then just verify the uh, system of time and date and IP address of the file so you can get the file or IP address of it. That's it. You can use the simulator for the practice.